Welcome to this NX Health Tip. When you click for a new file, you're presented with a new file dialog. From here you can select a template of various types to begin your work. The options that are displayed are controlled by PAX files. For your information, the blank templates list at the bottom can be turned off in the customer defaults. The PAX files are found on the Templates folder in your UGII folder where NX is installed. By default there are 20 PAX files for all the different template types. Those starting with NXDM are for use with Managed NX, i.e. Team Center. The ones starting with UGS are for Native NX, without Team Center. In this video, the Drawing and Sheet template PAX files are the ones we are interested in. Open them with the text editor and you can see that they are an XML formatted file. As with all XML, start tags are in greater than less than symbols. End tags have the forward slash as well. So the palette is started and then ended. You can also see that the name of the tab in NX is controlled by File New Tab. For each entry that appears in a File New, there is a palette entry. We can see that the first one corresponds to the A-size sheet. Most important is the file name, which specifies the name of the template file to use. The simplest way to add your own template is to copy an existing palette entry and paste it in. Pick a unique ID, it can be anything as long as it is only used once in the file. You can then edit the presentation name, description and tooltip to be what you want to see inside NX. Starting a new session of NX, you can see our new entry appears along with the description and tip.
To create our tab, simplest way to start is save as the existing PAX file and specify a new tab name. A new session of NX and you can see we now have our own tab. There are also the sheet template packs files which work in a very similar way. When you start drafting with no sheet or add a new sheet, you can specify a sheet template. If we do the same as before and copy an existing entry, we can add the new templates to the sheet list. Keep in mind that the templates need to be in the same folder as the PAX files unless you specify the full path to the template. 